I'm Sophie. And I'm Catherine. We're sisters. And business partners. We ditched our corporate jobs to follow our dreams. To make the best tasting cakes. This, this won't be easy. I'm sorry, but this is just unfair. I make so many more cakes than you per hour and I get paid less. How is that unfair? I make all of the intricate cakes. It wouldn't make sense for me to be paid less. It's good the way it is right now, where I make more money than you. Are you joking? No, I'm not. I think I should be paid more and you should be paid less. At least I picked up the purple drinks to match the purple cakes for the party tonight. I do all the professional work around here. Well, did you even taste those drinks? We need to taste them right away. I'll taste them and give you my professional opinion. Hey, give that to me. These are disgusting, Catherine. Do you feel funny? What happened? We shrunk, you fool. What? This is what happened in Alice in Wonderland. How on earth are we going to become big again? And how are we going to make the cakes? Girls, where are you? We're over, over here. here! We drank drinks for the party and it shrunk us. Girls, listen to me very carefully. I don't know how this happened, but I know that you need to work together to figure this out and get back to your original size. You have until 3.30. Let's go. I'm not working with her. She thinks that she should be paid more than me per hour. I should. I make all the fancy cakes, which take a lot more time and effort. But I make more cakes than you per hour. <sighs> Let's figure out a solution so that you both make the same amount of money per hour. I make six cakes per hour and get paid $11 less than Sophie per cake. And I make four cakes every hour. Okay, so let's work it out. Let's try guess and check to be precise. So first I tried $20. 4 times 20 is 80. Now for Catherine, 6 times 20 minus 11 is equal to 54, so that's too low. So now we're trying $30. 4 times 30 is equal to 120. Then 6 times 30 minus 11 equals $114, so that's still too low. Let's try $32. 4 times 32 is $128. 6 times 32 minus 11 equals $126, so now we're getting closer. This time we're trying $33. 4 times 33 is 132. 6 times 33 minus 11 also equals 132. So based on my guess and check, Sophie must make $33 per cake for the girls to make the same amount per hour. Mom, are you sure that's correct? I know my baking is not great, but my math is. How about we ask Olivia to come to make sure we're correct? Yeah, that sounds great. Olivia, coming. Am I dreaming or something? Nope. I'll explain later, but right now we need your help as soon as possible. Olivia, can you please help us figure out how much money Sophie needs to make per cake so that Sophie and I can make the same amount of money per hour? Mom did it in a guess and check way, but we don't know if she's correct. Do you know any other ways? Okay, I think I can set up an equation to solve that. Sophie earns x and Catherine earns x minus 11. 4 times x is equal to 6x, six, 6 times x minus 11. So 4x equals 6x minus 66. Now we add negative 6 to both sides, which leaves us with negative 2x equals negative 66. The total is 33. Now that that is solved, you guys need to work together to get back to full size. I have an appointment, so I need to go. Yay, we did it! Yes! We're still small. I was hoping that after we solved our equation, we would be able to return back to full size. At least we'll be small sisters together. Uh, why are we even up here? Don't you remember we were tasting the drinks? Oh yeah, that was crazy. And did you not realize that once we solved our problems, we became big again? Oh, so that's why math counts. I get it. Catherine, that was insane. Now let's go finish up preparing for this party. 30 minutes left. We can do it, don't worry. Take two.